Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. And I normally do my presentations in the same way that I sing, without any real notes. But today is too important. <laughs> the Syme Derby, human rights is all about our corporate values. Values of integrity and responsibility. But within that are our sustainability beliefs of respect and protection. Human rights is at the core of our sustainability work. But because we recognize that children and young workers are particularly a vulnerable group, our work has focused and led us to develop a child protection policy. I think it's easy to care for children who are connected to you by blood or by family. But if that connection is more distant, the degree of separation makes it more difficult. But that can't absolve either the company or the individual from a duty of care. We have 130,000 employees and their dependents working for Syme Derby. That scope of that duty of care is huge. And when you think that we operate in 26 countries, and many of those countries are developing, and the levels of maturity of their governments and their capabilities are not fully formed, then it is quite an awesome task. But we can't let that scale diminish our corporate responsibilities or to be an excuse and a lack of corporate action. Multinational, we have to have what we call a global perspective, but to view that through a local lens. For us, our anchor is the Sustainable Development Goals, and our framework is the children's rights and business principles, but executed down at the community level. It's all very well having those principles, but as a company, we've got to really turn them into practices. For us, it's not the marketplace. We don't produce services. We don't sell to children. It's about creating a child-safe and a child-friendly working environment for all of our employees. We believe we employ families, not just adults. We also, with 43,000 small farmers in our supply chain, recognize our wider commitments to the community. So our focus is not just on the workplace, it's on those communities that surround us. And our activities are on safe environments, protection of the young and their caregivers, elimination of child labor and ever-present debt, and particularly in palm oil, child security and, where necessary, child-centered emergency relief. You see, we believe the community is a stakeholder, and it's vital that community needs shape and define our corporate response and our actions. But really, no one size fits all, and that's why engagement is so vital. Often re operating in remote areas, the community views the company as the de facto government in terms of social requirements. So we believe that we have a corporate as well as an individual moral imperative to work with that wider community. But to do so, we need to go beyond our boundaries. Just the presence of Syme Derby creates a, a gravitational pull. And while we may have control more so in the workplace, when it comes to communities, we can only ever exert influence. But that presence can have a ripple effect. It's why we developed what we call the one-hour principle, with its access within one hour to water, to health and education, in places like Papua New Guinea and Liberia. And why also we look at environmental concerns, particularly in taking zero burn, in the ASEAN reason we all know about haze. In a sense, you have to go beyond boundaries. It's sustainability, sans frontier, human rights beyond borders. But the scale, the magnitude, the lack of boundaries, the geography is somewhat scary. And the complexity of the issues that we have to deal with and the inequalities and the emotions that that generates is frightening. But as my children have taught me, when the world gets a little bit scary, 
hold someone's hand. And at Syme Derby, we're not too proud to offer our hand and help and receive it in partnerships with any organisation that seeks to further the cause of children's rights. We firmly believe you cannot go it alone. Thank you.